Aloha, beautiful fam, luminosity here to do a little drop in about the energies that are coming in, about all the love and assistance that is coming in, about that great heavy shield that is being lifted off the human heart as we come to the end of an amazing play on this planet. And so a lot of people are probably experiencing a great release today as a lot of energy comes, is lifted off. It's like the veils are being lifted one quantum leap at a time and the amazing eclipse that we just went through just lifted probably the biggest heavy veil off the human heart yet, which is that one that had us still believing that we were a role in a play and that we were a personality. And so today's love stream is called What the World Needs Now is Love Sweet Love because that's what's flooding in for all of us. And just to be really supported to bring this energy into our bodies and our beings to understand that we, for a long time, were very limited in our experience of love because we were playing roles in a play. And a lot of people are going to start really experiencing now the complete letting go of everything that does not feel in total alignment with joy and happiness and most importantly, liberation of our energy. So if we were in a play and everyone's role in the play required everyone else to play their role in the play for the success for the play to be successful, we could basically say that now all the roles in the play are released. So no one has to keep playing any role in the play in order for someone else's role in the play to be successful. And that's the push pull dynamics of the reality that we are closing out called duality in totality. We've been working on this for a long time and these eclipses now, the Gemini Sag eclipses are the real thing. So the Sag is the dreamer and the Gemini gets it done. And this, these eclipses now are in these nodal accesses, accesses. So it's the get things done moment. And what we're getting done is the releasing in totality, the relinquishing of our belief that we were an identity that was controlled by a small self that had us do all kinds of things and led us on a great exploration of a reality. And so because enough of us chose 2020 to be the moment of completion, 2020 has brought um, a lot of liberation, a lot of tests. It was kind of like squeezing, you know, an entire century into what we call a year in time. And that's the best because we got the job done. And we know it for sure because you can feel it in the human consciousness. If this love stream is inspiring, please share it. That's called gifting. And so um, I have been guided to do these online retreats in the last few weeks. Let me just show you the amazing sunset. Look at those rays streaming off the sun. It's so incredible. So yeah, um, I have been guided to do these online retreats that I've been sharing for the last few weeks. And this week's retreat is called um, Eclipse Fest, Go Quantum. And seeing as the Eclipse Fest that was gonna be held in Chile isn't happening, let's do it online. And that's what we're doing this week. I have put details in the description box if you wanna join in. Tonight is gonna to be our second meditation. And so I have been receiving a lot of incredible downloads of um, the activation of our nine arc Merkabas and that's what we're gonna be doing tonight. And one of the things I wanna share about that is that when we go through our graduation on the all nine levels of who we are, we literally work our consciousness. Oh my gosh, I can see dolphins jumping out in the water. How cool is that? Um, 
so when we go through the graduation of all the stargates inside of ourselves we start to lift the veils at every level of our being our physical our mental emotional our astral we let go we go through all of those different stargates of our being and so we did a meditation in february of 2019 called the aurora and tonight we're going to take the aurora to the next level so if you were part of the aurora then you might want to participate tonight in this event um, and the guidance is just going to keep bringing through all the keys step by step in very easeful ways of how to activate our diamond light bodies so um, I just want to say that one of the metaphors to work with right now whatever phase we're at in our journey is to consider this is just a metaphor it's not making anything good bad right or wrong just consider that something called the ego took our soul hostage or took it for a ride in a car one of the metaphors that i've been using in um, the online retreats is that you know the ego was the driver in the car and we were in the passenger seat and we were handcuffed in a way just like how houdini broke out of the straitjacket and so as we wake up in the car um, we might invite the ego to move over and make some way for us and if the ego doesn't it's a jump out the window tuck and roll and um, that's really where a lot of people are at is the jump out of the window tuck and roll which is why transformation will come really quickly for a lot of people in their lives and um, other people have been working through it along the way making friends with the driver in the driver's seat and um, having the opportunity to kind of make friends with that aspect of ourselves so that we can use it to our highest expression and um, come into a coherent alignment to be creative and create. Because ultimately the purpose of existence is to create, be an artist of creation. And so if you just consider the metaphor that the ego took the soul hostage, that's what each one of us has been working for is to liberate ourselves from that aspect of the consciousness and there's nothing outside of us there's no evil force to reckon with it's just that journey of the serpent and the dove within to get the spirit back within our beautiful avatar our beautiful merkaba and light the light ship up and do an inner interdimensional journey to new exploration and new realms and so that's what we are sharing on these um, amazing retreats and tonight's meditation is going to be really cool so we love we and if this love stream is inspiring please share it that's called gifting all the notes are in the description box if you want to join us we have an incredible pod and we are the beauty of it is that we're all swimming together so no one has to feel alone or left out or lost as we navigate this part of the journey it's a pod effort it's pod play and a big piece for me is just that um, people have resources and no one feels alone in any way everyone feels supported in whatever way is the best way to feel supported let's take one more view of the sunset and those magnificent rays glorious glorious sunset so we love we we thank we and mwah, we all did it together and this is how we did it aloha